Okay, so hi guys! Um, I'm super excited for this video because I'm finally doing a favorites video, which I've never done before and I'm like super excited because like, I don't know, I have a lot of things that I like, but I don't necessarily like run out of them in a month. So this is more just like a kind of like all over, use it all the time, hasn't run out on me in a month favorites video. So I think the first thing would be this eye pencil and... It's from Mary Kay, and it is, it's like one of the Mary Kay at play pencils, so, and it's huge. Like, look at this, I didn't even know an eye pencil could be this big. And, but it's this really pretty green color, and it's this, um, it's called Green Tea. And all of their stuff is in French, too, which I really like, because I know what it says. So, you know, it has vert on it, which is green in French. And, I don't know, I really like it. I think it's pretty. But it's just like, like you th would think, because this is the color that it shows on the bottom. You would think that it's like a, like a green. And I wasn't, I was like, mm, green. But, it comes out really pretty. It's more like a gray. And, um, I don't know, I really like it. And I've used it a lot. And it's really good for the summer. So, I really like that. And then the second thing like makeup wise that I've been really into is the Mary Kay at Play lip gloss that I got too and it's one of like their jelly lips see and um it's just it's really pretty it's this like it's called hot tamale Let's see if I can show you guys that. See? and so it's like it's really it's not like red because it's like a jelly consistency um but I don't know I like it and it looks really good on my mouth hole <laughs> but uh yeah I don't know I just I, I've really been into it and I actually like I was a little hesitant for the Mary Kay at play because they're kind of like really vibrant colors like the hot tamale and the green and I was like um I don't really like to do color but they're actually not as like vibrant as you would think so I really like these two products, things, yeah. Um, then for more of like, I don't know, I guess you could call them hair care products. I've been really into this, I think it's like Matrix, Biolage, Styling, and it's this... Uh, it's like this new, I guess it's not new, it's just this product, I got it from Beauty Brands, and it's supposed to like help frizziness in your hair, and so like I like to put it in like right after I shower, and then I normally like braid my hair and go to bed, because I like to shower at night, but it's like really super easy, it's just like this, ah, I'm not gonna do that, it's this, um, it's just like this paste gooey stuff. And you just, like, put a little bit in your hand. And so I think that's why it's lasted me so long is because, like, I literally use, like, this much every time I use it. So I think that really helps keep it. But I really like it, and it really does, like, help keep my hair non-frizzy. But, yeah. And then the next product is my mousse, which I love this mousse. I just kind of like I hadn't actually used a mousse before I was more like into hairspray and stuff and then I was like well you know why don't I just get some mousse because you know it's like gel and hairspray had a baby and they made mousse and I literally love it and it's supposed to be for curl care see if you can see that I don't know if you can um but I use it for everything like literally I get done straightening my hair and I just put a little bit to do like the little frizzy pieces and if you don't have frizzy pieces good on ya but I do and it's Tresemme which I really like and it's like their Tresemme professionals and I don't know it's like extra hold which I think I like because it's more like hairspray like if you have like hairspray like mo like gels over here mousse is in the middle and then hairspray is over here it's like more on the hairspray side but I really like it. It works really well. And 
I have to say if I run out of this, I'm going to have to get more. All right, so the next thing I liked, and this is more of like a, oh God, that was a good catch. Uh, this is more like a body product, I guess. Um, and I don't even know if Bath & Body Works sells this brand anymore. I found it a couple weeks ago in a purse and I was like, oh, I actually like, and it, I like this smell. And it was the, it's their like Charmed Life um, lo body lotion. And I think, I don't know, it has jojoba and shea butter. I don't know if I'm saying that right. It was the vitamin E. And it works really good and it like smells really good. Mm. And I just, I love it, especially like now that it's summer and I've been shaving my legs and I've actually been trying to look nice. Um, it's nice to like put on after I shave and it doesn't like irritate my skin or do anything like that. So I really liked this, but this one actually is almost gone. So you can hear it. Um, but I'm too, I don't know. I need to go back and get something else. When I do, I'll let you guys know. Um, so that's pretty much all of like the hair care stuff that like I really like. Oh, I've also been liking this. As you can tell, it's dirty and gross because I've been using it all the time. So this is like the heat seal. It's from, it's the Paul Mitchell, I don't know, it might be Mitchell, I think it's Mitchell, um, soft style series. And it's the heat seal. And I've really been liking this stuff because um, I feel like it's actually helping my hair stay healthy from the heat, which I haven't actually been using a lot lately, but when I was straightening it once or twice a week, I really like to use this stuff. But like in the morning, you know, after you wake up, you just kind of get into your routine and you straighten your hair and then you're like, oh crap, I had my heat seal and I didn't use it. Chucks. Um... So I started putting it at, on at night with this stuff. I would put this stuff in, and then I would spray my hair with this, and then I would braid it and sleep with it, and then I would straighten it the next day. And it actually came out like really soft, surprisingly. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, so I really like this stuff. I don't know if they sell it anymore because I've been using it all the time, but I bet they do. But I need to buy more of this too because see, you can hear it's, it's empty. It's almost empty. <laughs> But I haven't been straightening my hair that much, so I don't know. Maybe once school starts again. Um, so for books, this nice time, I've, of course, been into The Fault in Our Stars. And I've actually read this book a while ago, um, probably like last summer. Um, and then the movie was going to come out, which I saw. Um, and I decided to read it again, and it's just, like, after seeing the movie, you actually can see the characters in the book more clearly in your head, I guess, and I, I feel like it makes the book better, especially when the movie was good, because the movie was good. I'll talk about that later.